What is going on YouTube? We're going into round three of the Modern Challenge. And I beat Ponza in two con pretty convincing games in round two and then beat up on Boggles in round one. So we have played some pretty non-interactive magic so far. My dog's people watching. Here, like six. Jesus Christ. That's more views than like magic ever has. Play against. I don't recognize my opponent's name. And we're going to keep this hand. A little bit sketchy. Only one land and a Bloodbraid Elf, but. Okay. Eldrazi Temple. So we're probably playing against that new Eldrazi deck. Another elf is no bueno. Okay. We're getting sketchy. I'm going to forego this lightning bolt and go get Overgrown Tomb because it lets me cast Thoughtseize and Traverse the Uvenwald to give me another out for a land. Wow. I, this has got to be a mulligan. You kept three Serum Powders. Like, right? That doesn't make sense. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah. Land. All right. Sweet, we go get a Death Shadow. You would be Chris Brown. <laughs> I woke up in Chris Brown's body. If he goes to dismember this, I'm just gonna bolt myself. That's just how we drew it up. There's the ghost quarter. Yeah, cast and serum powder. Kill. I'm not gonna decay this because this thing doesn't matter. What would my opponent have for spells? There's no good spells, so this brutality is basically just gonna like kill a matter reshaper or something. So like the serum powder could enable chalice on two. So if my opponent chalice is on two, I'll just decay it. All right. I don't really know what's happening. My opponent's hand is Serum Powder X. We definitely have, if we draw a fetch land, we're gonna kill our opponent. That'd be gas. A Street Wraith kills my opponent. A Traverse kills my opponent. Oh, they just scooped it up. Lightning Bolt killed my opponent. No, it didn't. Left them a one. I don't understand why they kept that. So I don't really know how to sideboard in this matchup. Uh, I think I want all the artifact and big creature removal. And I do think this is a Bloodbraid Elf matchup. Like, I do just kind of want to get on the battlefield and control the battlefield. I think Liliana the Last Hope is also good because it deals with Eternal Scourge every turn. Um, and then probably my Fatal Push. Cards that I know are not good. Collective Brutality is garbage. Lightning Bolt's not great because it, it only kills, like, matter. It only really kills... Um, Whatever that dumb card is. Uh, Mimic. And I'm gonna cut a traverse because they're gonna they're gonna their deck's like four deep in relics. Well, okay, so now I'm actually gonna keep cut one more traverse. Because they got four relics. So I could bring in Battle Rage, because like Battle Rage is another card, they just can't beat it. Like you're just never beating Battle Rage in a million years. Probably can side out like one Kolagon's Command and one Lightning Bolt. Like Bloodbird Elfing into Battle Rage kind of feels bad, but they're just never beating this card. What's Ninja's sub count? What is it? Is there is it more than is it more than twenty two thousand? 
He gets ad revenue too. His ad revenue must be off the charts. All right, well this hand is not good in the face of a relic, but besides that, it's pretty good. So maybe my opponent will do something, they won't play a relic on one. Okay, I keep. Oh my God. He's got 180,000 subs. My God, he's gonna he's gonna make a million dollars a year. I'm gonna do the math on that after my match. All right, leading on ghost quarter is odd. I'd sell for like a hundred. All right, that card's annoying, but we're gonna definitely we're definitely just casting Tarmal Life next turn. So we don't really have time to, you know, play off curve to deal with it. Take a ratchet bomb. My hands, my opponent's hands, garbage again. Like we're gonna play Tarmac Wave next turn, or unless wait, well, he goes put a counter, put a counter. So we're not gonna play Tarmac Wave this turn. Yeah, that's all right. So now we'll take the Thought Not Seer. And probably just get a tap land with this. Yeah, it's not including sponsors or revenues. Oh, yeah, the end, the, uh, yeah, it's, uh, whatever it is, Arena. Okay, so now we're gonna go bing bing. And we're gonna wait, I'm not gonna do this in my main phase. Oh, I, I did that poorly. I thought they I thought they hit the end step. Okay. That's me, that's 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 up for a really good turn next turn. Where I can go like I'm gonna have delirium, so I can, can go like traverse for Death Shadow, play Death Shadow, and Thought sees our opponents. My opponent. All right. Well, now we're just gonna go bing bing. Opponent's got three cards. They've had they've had a pretty unfortunate draw this game. Like I don't know if they're supposed to keep their hand or not, but they kept it on the strength of Ratchet Bomb. That card's not gonna do anything. Um. I'll get a second red source so I can't get hit off Battle Rage. Destroy target artifact. Yes. Well, bang. Yeah, I think we're just going to one shot our opponent next turn. Facial contortion doesn't do anything. I guess I'll just take a matter of shaper. Yeah, pretty pretty anemic draw from our opponent. We don't even have to play this fetch land now because it's not like they can go spatial contortion and dismember. Yeah, pretty unfortunate draw. So if I find a way to deal myself damage, they're dead. Okay. I didn't do that. I'm going to play this so I can have Revolt up. And just play Tom Life. No need to go fetch Shock here. Then we're just going to kill our opponent.
Okay. 